All right. We would like to ask Senator, State Senator Linda Dorsini Forey to come up. No, I'm going to be with the Pope Senator Padua, Linda Dorsini Forey. I'm going to say, I'm going to be with the Pope And what a turnout. Ms. Amigade Moon. But this is beautiful. I just want to thank um, the folks who put this together. So many people, but I'll just mention three for now. Oswald, Bernadette, Kiki. Want to thank the Haitian clergy, Haitian media, but the Haitian community for coming out tonight, right? For coming out tonight and sharing um, your vision and some of the issues you may have, but also having our wonderful mayor of our great city, Mayor Marty Walsh, here with us. So thank you. Mayor. So I want to thank my colleagues in government. Um, they were mentioned earlier, but I want to especially highlight them. For me, merci pas seulement magistrano, mais que l'autre monde est ici là tout. On nous connaît ces mêmes mêmes seulement qui aïe ces amis qui aïe ici, mais nous que les amis qui pas aïe ici. Mais on l'a avec nous aujourd'hui. So I want to take this time to recognize Representative Dan Cullinane, please stand. <laughs> Representative Russell Holmes is here. <laughs> City Councilor Tim McCarthy. Let me go and let me pass this state to the city and then go to the federal level. Let me get problems with immigration. Let me get the office. Let me get the examiner. No longer. So I want to thank when there's issues around federal issues or immigration, right? Although we work in the state and the city, but there's our partners in Congress. And I want to thank Candace Seely's here from Congressman Michael Capuano. Stephanie, of course, she was mentioned before, but I gotta mention again, former state representative Marie St. Fleur. Yes, stand up, Marie. So, okay, so I, my role is to introduce our mayor, right? Yes, yes, okay. Oh, of course, I'm gonna talk about that. Okay, okay, yeah, don't worry. So my role is to introduce the mayor, I'm gonna introduce my magister, a Magistrat Walsh, but I don't have an introduction, no new phone in, right? He doesn't really need an introduction because he knows this community. He knows the issues that we face in the Haitian community. He was a state representative for 17 years. We don't debut for 17 years. We are in Dorchester, we are working with us. The Marie Saint Fleur is here, all the things. So we are here, we are here, we are here. I'm going to say, as mayor, one of the first things Mayor Walsh did um, in the first month in office, he sent out 10 of his chiefs, the head of his cities, to come out to Mattapan Square and to walk the square and to listen and to meet with the businesses and to find out what is it we need to get done in the square. So that's incredible, right? Because that was one of his first things that he did. What you think about this? Square. Parce que là, on connaît qu'il dit l'autre bois, l'homme tape et l'homme tape et l'exionné. T'es que problème à business nous y a. La rue y a mis des clean, sidewalks y a mis des clean. Et puis mon y a sorti y a power wash, they cleaned everything. So thank you, Mayor, for that. And thank you for the team. Now, he did a couple other things, but I want to take the time to recognize some of his chiefs who are here, right? I mean, we have Jerome Smith, who's chief of the gay community participation. We have his chief of housing, Sheila Dillons, here. Sheila Dillons, chef house. We have the new superintendent of schools who's here, Tommy Chan's here, stand up. So let us talk about the bagay de kai. Kone ke magistra se yun na preme bagay liti libre fe please kai ki affordable. The mayor, one of his initiatives is to create more housing that people can afford, right? And that's a big deal. And we hear it a lot in our offices, um, people calling about housing. The other piece I'll say is that it was the first time, I would say, in BHA's history that the application was translated in Haitian Creole. And that was because of Mayor Walk, right? And also the video was done in Haitian Creole because of Mayor Walk. 
But we worked collaboratively with Representative Dan Cullinan and all of us when we did the first housing fair, housing clinic here in Mattapan. Parce que nous comprenons que ou pas qu'à dire ou qu'une communauté haïtienne l'aigue en application par le créole, pas vrai? So nous comprenons ça. So lui dit mettez le créole, l'aigue film n'a pas et pas seulement anglais pour le créole. So son bon bagage. So nous disons ça. I say that because he's not a stranger to our community. I'll say that the mayor has been um, Mattapan Square again in terms of the money. Thank you, mayor, working with us in the state level to get the $500,000 for beautification. So, $600,000 for Mattapan Square. Because the work that we have done with Representative Dan Cullinan, we have done with women. Even if we have done with the people who are not going to be able to do it, we have done with the people who are not going to be able to do it. One thing you may not know as I talk about the beautification, but this is a big one, just so they know that he is Haitian, okay? I know he's an Irish guy from Dorchester. But Marty, Mukadinu Sase Aisiene, Pase Marty, Mayor, Marty Walsh, Avec Deputy Le Marie Saint Fleur, Le Marie Saint Fleur, Yale Haiti. Come on now. When he was a state rep, he's been to Haiti. And so when he came back, he was really amazed, right, Marty? And was like, wow, this is an incredible country with incredible people. So it's an honor for me, you guys. So on every month, I'm going to be here with you. Like the Senate, the premier Haitian-American Senate in Massachusetts. But I'm going to introduce you to me. I'm going to introduce you to me. I'm so proud and an honor to introduce my friend and your friend, our mayor, Marty Walsh. Thank you, Senator Fari. Merci, Senator Fari. I want to round of applause for Senator Fari. Thank you very much.